I just think that this is our opportunity as Queensland to really show our passion for netball and how much we support netball. We're so lucky to have these two teams that are in such close proximity to each other. So I hope all Queensland netball fans, regardless of whether they support the Firebirds or the Lightning, get out to the game next weekend. And the Vixens have played really, really strong competitive matches for the first three games of the season and it'll be great to see what they do again this weekend. I can't wait to see them line up against us next week. I think it'll be an incredibly tough contest. And that's the best thing about Suncorp Super Netball is that every single week the matches that are being played are really competitive and tight. And when you're a spectator sitting in the stands, it just doesn't get any better than that. So get out next week, support the Firebirds, wear your purple and just be loud and proud. So I was lucky enough tonight to be invited to speak at a UQ alumni function and being a proud UQ alumnus, uh, yeah, it was fantastic just to mingle with, I suppose, people who went to my university and I suppose educate them a little bit about netball. I think the girls did a really amazing job. Each week they're coming out on court and they're just building and tonight there's that little bit of a rivalry that exists between us and the Swifts regardless of the fact if it's a new competition. So I know that the girls really were hoping to get, you know, come away with a win and I just thought they put together a really solid four quarter effort. It was a tough match uh, but there were some wonderful performances out there. I thought that Kimberly Jenner came on and did a beautiful job and then you know Shimo in her 50th game it was a really special win for her and you know I just thought that they combined beautifully together and again Erin Berger's debut on the Queensland home court in front of what is her new family in terms of the Purple Army was just phenomenal I think she's doing a great job. I think they felt a lot of pressure on them before the season started but the wonderful thing that they're doing is just making the most of the opportunities that Rosalie's presenting to them and they're all constantly asking questions and wanting to learn and I think they're putting their own flavour and style of netball into the defensive end and that's really fantastic. I mean to see Shimo come out and get these amazing rejections and wonderful intercepts and then Clemmy just providing that stability in the back line is great. And what more do you want than having upcoming Queensland talent like Kim Jenner stepping onto the court and just looking like she's been playing there for years?